in the last 28 days, I had received over 50,000 views on LinkedIn and I did not write a single piece of content by myself. I just created an AI tool that writes a LinkedIn post for you and I'm giving it away for absolutely free. Now, let me show you a quick demo of how this particular tool works, right? Now, first things first, uh, this is a simple Excel sheet. I prefer Excel sheets always, or Google sheets always, right? So it has a couple of uh, fields that you can enter in. Like first field is who do you serve? In my case, I put coaches, consultants, and marketing agencies. What country does your target audience reside in? I put India. What are the top three problems that your market is facing? Well, let me just show you this. Yeah. And what are the top three topics of expertise through which you solve the problem? This is what I kind of built. Now, this particular data is passed on through OpenAI. Basically, ChatGPT takes this data and crunches it and creates a lot of topics, the content topics that I need to write on. Now, this goes through a particular iteration system so that all the ideas are like divided into multiple uh, blocks and each of these blocks is posted on the same Google Sheet right here in the content tab. Now, mind you, you have to create this Google Sheet yourself and basically link it here. Basically click here and you know link your spreadsheet where it says spreadsheet ID. Just link your own sheet there, right? And here again, same thing instead of your connection, uh, my connection, add your own connection, right? And the tutorial to do that is somewhere on the I button, right? Now, next is this, right? Once the topic are ready, all of this are added to the topics column, as you can see, topics value. And in the same Google Sheets, I have something called as topic and I have something called as content. So topic is something that is written here. And this topic again goes through, each of these topics again goes through OpenAI to write the content. And once the content is written, it gets pasted right here. Now, the reason why I'm not posting on LinkedIn directly because currently LinkedIn absolutely hates automation and uh, it has a tendency to block a lot of accounts and I don't want you to suffer from that, right? Now, let me show you a quick demo of how this tool works. I'll just simply click on run once and then let's see the magic. Here you go. <laughs> it's so cool. Here's why relying on referrals is killing your business growth. Look at the hook. Referrals are keeping you stuck. Yes, they bring in good clients. Yes, they feel effortless. But if you rely on them too much, you're setting yourself for slow or no growth. There you go. Right? It writes entirely 30 days worth of content in like, I don't know, five minutes, 10 minutes, whatever it takes. Right? And you can simply copy and, you know, schedule your post on LinkedIn or paste them on the right time. Now, if you want to use this particular AI tool, all you have to do is go to the description of my video and click on this particular link. Now, once you click on this link, you'll come across this particular page where you can simply put your first name, email address and download. And once you click on download, you come across this particular Google Doc and you can check the 11th, uh, you know, uh, line here which says LinkedIn content writer you get all the prompts that I have written and all the AI automation simply click on this one and you'll go to my Google Drive and just download this particular thing right here simply click on download and it will download as a JSON file in your computer and all you have to do is pretty much go back I'll just save the changes for now and uh, in your make.com scenario, you definitely need a make.com account if you want to learn how to use this. It's the link of that particular tutorial is somewhere in the description. You can click on create new scenario. We will basically click on this one and import blueprint and select and choose the file right here and click on save. There you go. This will be imported to you. And if you want to like make it really neat and clean, click on this auto align. It will like look pretty decent now go into each of this and simply log into your account simply click on add if you want to add your own google account and select a spreadsheet like this i suggest you create the spreadsheet yourself uh, you can put this column who do you serve what country do, does your target audience reside in what are the top three problems and what are the top three topics of your expertise and basically select that particular spreadsheet by clicking here and searching for the name of that particular spreadsheet. Okay, you don't need to touch anything else. Then here, again, you can simply click on this add button, it will show you all the tutorials on how to add the OpenAI API key. 
And you can use this exact prompt that I have added here, which pretty much goes like, your job is to research on the niche and create content ideas. Here are the details, you put the details. Do in-depth research and create 30 pieces of content, divide them into five pillars. Each of the topics, I need to teach my customer something new and crazy in the field that solves the specific problems. Mainly focus on mistakes my niche makes and the problems they face. These content ideas should build my authority and possibly go viral on LinkedIn or in LinkedIn, whatever. And there are some rules. Right, you can just keep it as is. The link to this prompt is also inside the document. So basically, if you click on the prompts here, you'll find the exact prompt in case this doesn't appear. Now, all of this is sent through tools. What happens is, uh, if I just run this one once again, you'll see that in here, this particular thing, uh, so I'll just show you the output. There you go. It's like, big block of text right we want to divide this into 30 different parts so this particular tool uh, basically divides them into multiple parts here there you go see each of this has become like a different separate line item how do you know you can see these small small lines right here so you know that each of the 30 topics have been divided into different different lines and each of those lines are individually passed through this particular tool called as iterator to the next Google Sheet, right? So each of this operation is basically um, this one, basically like individual topics. And each of these individual topics are going through the OpenAI channel here, right? to create content and each of this content is again added to the Google Sheets right here. So I'll stop it for now and I'll show you where else to log in. Now here you can see this is called search rows. Here it says add a row because they're adding a new row with every title and make sure that uh, you have a separate tab where you have this particular headline called topics and below topics it says value from the iterator so that you don't miss it. And then second thing in the Google Sheets right here, uh, this says update a row. It will update the row right next to each of these topics. So you have to select the row number of this particular Google Sheets and add the content of the uh, OpenAI by simply clicking here and going to um, choices message content right here, right? So we're all good. And one more formula in case this gets missed is inside this tools, just, uh, you know, just use this split function. It will split all of these uh, ideas that ChatGPT gives into multiple lines using this particular formula, split, choices, message, and pound symbol. If you can notice here in the prompts, I have instructed ChatGPT to end each of the ideas with a pound symbol or hashtag symbol and each topic with a pound. And what this tool does is it identifies that line item of, not the item, but that, that particular symbol of pounds and it breaks that line into another line, right? So the function is split. And then here you basically select, go to open AI, choices, message, and then semicolon and pound symbol here and click on save. There you go. So this is a very simple workflow that you can download by using the method that I just shared. And if you liked it, please share this video with some of your friends, anybody who might need this. And, uh, you know, if you are a LinkedIn content creator or you are a freelancer, ghostwriting for other people, this tool might really help you. And if it does help you, let me know in the comments, what does it make you feel? Thank you very much for watching and see you in the next video.